Today I'm going to share with you the best ways to know you have the real extra virgin olive oil. I'm, now I'm not sure if you saw my other videos or not on this topic, but near 80% of all the olive oil sold is actually fake. In other words, it's not the high quality olives picked and immediately cold pressed. It's usually some diluted olive oil with sometimes canola oil. Uh, sometimes they use solvents, preservatives. All right, the best test to know you have the real stuff is a little tickle or a cough in the back of your throat, a slight irritation because of a very specific phytonutrient called oleocanthal. Oleocanthal is a super healthy anti-inflammatory antioxidant. Now, it's not going to be a major irritation. You're not going to start coughing a lot, but it's just going to create a little bit of a sensation back there. And so you know you have the real deal. I mean, for years, I had no idea I wasn't consuming the real extra virgin olive oil. And I wasn't aware of that until I actually consumed some real olive oil. And you can really differentiate the difference. Real extra virgin olive oil is fruity, it's peppery, it's pungent, it's bitter. It's, it has a slight grassy taste, but it's delicious versus the fake olive oil, which is just bland. It doesn't taste like anything. Now, you'd want to buy extra virgin olive oil in glass containers, not plastic. And the real stuff is not less than $10. It's usually between $10 and $40 because it costs more to make, and it's definitely worth it. I mean, if you're buying three liters of extra virgin olive oil for $18, it's not the real stuff. And I think um, it would also be worth it to find their website and see what their story is. Is there a story about the type of olive they use? Do they talk about the process? Do they actually reveal where it's made? And the real extra virgin olive oil is pressed, it's crushed, and it has a harvest date on the bottle. Now, the one that I use comes from Italy, and I've actually been to the farm where they grow the olives, and I observe the process of making olive oil. It's extremely high quality, and I put a link down below if you want to check it out. But there's many different places you can get the real stuff. All right, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Hey, before you go, if you're benefiting from any of my content, I would love to hear about your success story. Please share it in the link down below.